everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have an unboxing. Um, I asked over on my Instagram if you guys preferred an unboxing or a reveal and it was close to 50-50. So I haven't opened it yet because I didn't have a chance so I'm just gonna go ahead and open it because I just got off work and I can't wait. So anyway, it's from Fashion File. I will, it's kind of a repurchase, like it's not but it is, so I'll explain at the end. But right now, let me show you, and then if you wanna hear why I got it, I'll explain at the end. Okay, so I opened the top just cause my address is there, so, you know, but I didn't look yet. All right, so it is from Fashion File, and it's still sealed. <laughs> so they did put a little bit of these things, but not a ton, which is great, cause you know, Anyway, the receipts, they're normal stuff. <sighs> okay, so this said it was in excellent condition. Um, it's Louis Vuitton, so it said it had a little bit of patina on it, and that's pretty much it. So I'm kind of nervous. I hope that it's in the condition that it says, <laughs> but yeah, here we go. There's my file. Okay, so came in this dust bag. I don't remember if it said it came with a dust bag or not, but yeah, they always come in a fashion file dust bag anyway. I literally bought this yesterday, so. <laughs> oh, I hope it's good. Okay, so I got, ah, I got the delightful, but I got it in the MM instead of the PM. And it's with the P-Bone, however you say it, P-B-O-N, I don't know. I just say P-Bone, so just roll with it. Um, interior. No smells. Okay, let's see, guys. Let's check the condition. It's a very, very light patina. Extremely even. Oh, extremely, like, very faint corner wear, if any, actually. Very, very faint. Yep. So it looks like there's a spot there on the bottom that wiped right off, so that's perfect. Sorry, my hair looks like crap today. <laughs> I didn't straighten it. All right, the handle looks amazing. I think it's coming off darker than it is in person. I don't know if this is coming out correct, but it is super light. It's definitely super light. Ooh, the under is super light. That's one thing I was looking for. Ah, there we go. The actual Louis Vuitton dust bag. It's folded up. Oh my God, that's a huge one. It's huge. Okay. Doesn't smell like anything. Super excited. So this, uh, the interior is immaculate. Like, it's perfect. Just go over here, there. Let's see, the zipper is good. Uh, the size is great. And it did come with the um, key charm, which I loved on my last one. Okay, so there it is, and it's wonderful. So big and beautiful. Oh my gosh, I love it. I totally missed this color. Okay, I'm not gonna do a review or like sizing or anything like that right now. Um, I am going to tell you why I got it. So last week we spent the full, almost the full week at the beach and I saw the delightful and the Galliera everywhere. Like, I don't know if I was seeing the same people, but I definitely saw a few of them and they were so beautiful. I saw the Delightful, the Galli the Galliera, Gal am I saying that right? Galliera, and um, the Neverfull. Like I saw them everywhere and I was just like, oh, they're so beautiful. And um, a lot of them were super dark and super beautiful and oh, just totally made me miss having one. Um, I did have the PM of this bag, this exact bag with the same interior, and I was really annoyed all the time by the closure of it because 
I always had to fold it down. And since it was a little bit shorter, I mean like my stuff never fell out of it unless like I put it in the car and it fell over. But besides that, my stuff never came out. I never had an issue. I just got annoyed by the way it closed. So that's ultimately why I didn't reach for it and I sold it. <sighs> kind of, it's been one of those things that I regret ever since because something about how this looks when it's full and it sags is just so beautiful. And I have really missed having the one strap. Let's see, I've got my um, petite no -A's. Yeah, they're pretty much the only bags I have with one strap is my petite no -A's. And I've got four of those. Um, but then the other bags all have top handles, which I love. They have top handles and they have a strap. But I've really missed having bags just have one strap. I know that's dumb. Um, and although I love my petite noise, like it's my favorite style. Am I even in focus? Um, I have missed like the way that this sits against the body. I know that sounds silly, but the petite noise sticks out further and sometimes it's just not what I want to use. Like I can't, I can't explain it. I know this just sounds crazy and we are crazy, you know, whatever. But I really wanted it, especially after seeing it on everybody. It was usually that's something that turns me off. I'm like, if I see it so much, I don't want it. And I never see it around here where I live, but ugh, just tell you, like they were just beautiful. And I kept telling my husband, oh my God, look at that, look at that, how beautiful they were. And I couldn't get it out of my mind. Um, I had already been thinking about this one again for a little bit. I've mentioned it to a few of my friends and I think they thought I was crazy. I'm not sure, but I did it anyway. I couldn't help myself. So yeah, I'll put my stuff in it, make sure I absolutely love it. I'll relook through it, you know, make sure it's all good to go. And then I will cut the tag if it is. If it's not, I'll definitely let you guys know. But I wanted to share that really quick. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. So Bye. are you happy now? Things just got so crazy from a simple maybe. It was a long way down. I just feel so heavy. Without you, everything we were was